Welcome, I'm Dr. Akshay Jain. In today's video, we'll talk about hypoglycemia or low blood sugar and how to avoid it. Hi, my name is Amanda. I've had diabetes for the last two years and I recently had a very frightening experience. I was fast asleep in bed when I suddenly woke up feeling extremely queasy. I noticed that my heart was pounding. I was sweating all over. I was increasingly anxious and was confused. I remembered my doctor had told me that the symptoms could be suggestive of a low blood sugar. Somehow, I managed to make my way to the kitchen and grabbed a couple of muffins. About five minutes later, I felt much better and was able to go back to bed. However, I could not help but think what if this incident would have happened while at work, exercising, while I'm alone skiing, or when I'm driving. If I were to be just as confused while I was driving, the results could be disastrous. I might end up hurting myself or others. This made me extremely worried about the possibility of such low sugar episodes in the future. Almost all parts of our body, including the brain, depend on blood sugar for energy. Hence, if the sugar levels are low, there is a risk of malfunctioning of these organs. What exactly is hypoglycemia? It is basically when blood sugars are less than 4.0 or if someone accustomed to high sugar levels has lower than usual sugar readings with symptoms of low sugar. Symptoms can include rapid heart rate, increased sweating, anxiety, hunger, blurriness of vision, confusion, and even unconsciousness or death. What causes hypoglycemia? Certain medications used to treat diabetes, including certain pills or insulin injections, can cause hypoglycemia, especially when combined with excessive activity levels, skipping or delaying meals, or consumption of alcohol. Treatment of low sugars includes confirming by doing a blood sugar check and then consuming a rapid source of carbohydrate, such as any of the options listed here. Recheck your sugars 15 minutes after correction to ensure it has normalized. Sometimes, if the sugar is extremely low, one may not be able to correct it themselves. At such times, it is important to have a medication called glucagon handy which can rapidly correct low sugars. This can be administered by a bystander even when you are unconscious and is available both as an injection or nasal spray. Make sure you discuss with your doctor or healthcare team if you experience any episodes of low sugars. They may want to adjust your medications to ensure such episodes do not occur again. They may also ask you to check your sugars more often. To avoid such episodes, check sugars as directed, including before driving or operating heavy machinery. Learn to recognize the symptoms. Always carry rapid carbohydrates and use caution if increased activity or skipping meals. Remember, low sugars can be dangerous and should be avoided at all costs. Discuss with your healthcare team if you have low sugars and learn how to correct such episodes. I hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to like this video, share with friends and family, and subscribe to my channel for notifications.